Today we're going to be talking about building self-compassion. is looking at things from another's perspective and having that warm feeling and care and desire to help. Self-compassion is all that and then actually working to comfort and care for yourself. So asking yourself, how can I comfort and care for myself at this moment? Self-compassion involves self-kindness and not self-judgment. You need to recognize that being imperfect, failing, and experiencing life's difficulties are inevitable. I mean, you just are. So be gentle on yourself. Self-compassion involves recognizing that suffering and personal inadequacy are part of the human experience. They just are. They are not something that happened to me alone. They happen to all of us at some point in time. As such, I can give myself a break <laughs> when they happen. Okay? Self-compassion requires that we take a balanced approach to our so-called negative emotions so that we're neither, we neither suppress them nor exaggerate them. Just be willing to observe them with openness and clarity. Here are some exercises that may help build self-compassion. Think about how you would treat a friend and think how things might change if you start treating yourself the way you would treat a friend going through these circumstances. Give yourself a self-compassion break. I mean, at any time. Just give yourself a break and be kind to yourself and just observe your feelings. What am I feeling right now? How is it going? That's it. Explore self-compassion through writing. Okay? Write a letter to yourself addressing the shame or insecurity that you're going through, but from a place of compassion. Change your critical voice. I mean, we all have it. Acknowledge the critical voice when it comes in, and then cancel, block, delete it, and replace it with a more positive message. So for example, I'm stupid. Cancel, block, delete. I'm not stupid. I'm smart. I'm kind, and I'm intelligent. I just made a mistake. The exercises that I shared with you in this video can be turned into small daily exercises that help build self-compassion. You can join Harmonious Life um, Building Work Family Balance Group on Facebook for weekly and daily tips on small things that will help you build self-compassion for this year and beyond. If you want to discuss how you can build self-compassion for you know, your own self-compassion, you can contact me on raya at rayabarwani.com or if you, know how, you want to know how I operate, you can contact me on www.rayabarwani.com for more information. See you next time. Bye.